I already know, I'm giving you a lot right now. Okay, it's a lot for you to take in. Okay, so I'm just gonna describe what we're both already experiencing here. I'm giving you all kinds of Siberian Husky, okay? Bella Hadid, all right, sculpted. Like I haven't eaten in three days, you hear me? I look like Gabrielle Union on Two Can Play That Game. You know, when she she got that long ponytail and don't know how to act. Girl, how you been? Fine, where you headed? <laughs> up there to see your man, is he up there? Oh, he's up there. Let me go hard at that Negro. That's how I feel like I look right now. These lips. I feel cute. I feel real cute. I'm feeling foxy. Like I'm foxy Cleopatra only without a fur. Am I smizing yet? Is it happening? I'm trying to smize. Everybody's gonna be checking for you. Everybody's gonna be wanting to know, girl, how you did your eyes like that. I'm gonna show you. Sit down, relax, get a snack. You about to get into it. You know, I got a situation here, situation here. Oh, hi. Wait a minute. Who are you? They weren't invited to the party, but they showed up anyway, so it's okay. We still got hors d'oeuvres for you too. Have a seat. Get up. Now take a seat. Several seats. You see the glow? You see what's happening? Ooh, you see it. It's the Matte Poreless Classic Tan 355. Uh, the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation. I'm gonna go in with that. The True Complexion HD Corrector by Black Radiance. And this is in the shade uh, Yellow. You see how that did that? And Sculpt. You see that? I have very rounded cheeks. And because these cheeks are so round, sometimes I look a little bit like a squirrel. Today I look a little bit like a lemur. She like to move it, move it. She like to move it. But by the end, it's gonna look amazing. This brow is like, it got a spirit. And I like, oh, okay, shoots right back up there. <laughs> it needs Jesus. I think I'm gonna try to do the rest off camera because Y'all, I think y'all are making me nervous. I'm going in with Black Radiance's uh, banana powder. See how that just mattified everything? I like to put a little bit here, just to kind of bake as I go. Mm -hmm. I lightly dust my small lines, but not a lot. Let's do the eyes. I got this. This is an old palette. Um, I got it in my BoxyCharm. It's the Crown Pro Palette, beige taupe color. And I'm just gonna put that on the, just on the lid. Now I have almond shaped eyes. I have hooded eyes. So I'm going to really lightly remember with this boxy eye, everything is about. Are you smizing? No, you're not. Snatching. Okay, this is um, a brush from Morphe. I'm gonna take, there's like this chocolatey brown color. I'm gonna go in right here. And I'm just gonna, it's flat, it's a flatter brush, and I'm just gonna follow the shape. I'm creating the shadow. And you just want it to look like the shadows naturally create this foxy look. And you're gonna slightly blend upwards, just blend a little bit upwards. We're just creating the shadows. Now we're gonna go in with a fluffy blending brush and blend that out. Blend it. Blend it outwards like this and brush it inward. You want a little bit of definition in the crease, but it's not so much about the crease as it is about this outer corner. We're trying to create shadows. And you see, I didn't even use that much product, but you see this eye is hooded, so we have to go back in with a little bit more product. And I like to almost, I like to lift up my eye as well. So I'm just gonna go back in with that fluffy brush and use that same color I used on my lip and just lift it up. Lift that eye, lift. You see how that just changed the whole look. Like, I feel like I'm tired trying to smile, just like, there's this and there's this. <laughs> I 
Okay, girl. All right, so I'm gonna go in with Kat Von D's tattoo eyeliner. I like to even go right here. And it adds a little bit more that foxy look. Like, I know I'm a little bit ugly without brows and lashes on, but once I do have the brows and the lashes on, you can't tell me anything. What can you tell me? Nothing. This lash is, wants to fly away. I didn't realize how dramatic these lashes were gonna look, girl. We have to set the rest of this face, because we haven't done that yet. That face is still kind of wet. So I'm gonna use my Black Radiance palette, and I'm gonna go in between these two. You can see I use them a lot. Like whatever's left, and chisel out my double chin. And I like to just, with us baby hair girls, I just press it in. The highlight. I think this is really beautiful. And I didn't do anything on my bottom lash line either. I forgot the bottom lash line. How did I just, I'm sorry, y'all forgive me. Um, I'm gonna take this same crown palette. I'm gonna take this darker, it's almost like a plum color looking. And I'm gonna just go on the bottom lash line and get right up in there. But you know what? I don't feel like this is enough. I think I want to do this reddish brown. People is, or the iris is, and I don't go further than that. I don't go like inwards more than that. I just like kind of blow it out right there. I think that looks pretty. I could, I could easily, you know, walk out the house like this and not feel no kind of way, but I want nude. This is the NYX in the shade Stockholm. Some people feel like gloss is dead because we have to wear masks and everything, but I disagree. I'm still a fan of gloss, so I'm gonna go in with mood staining gloss. I'm gonna just apply that on top. Oh, I need my setting spray. Smashbox setting spray. And go back in, dab with that same beauty blender that's still got foundation on it, all that. I feel cute. Honey, I feel real cute. I feel like very Vanessa Williams with these blue eyes. Like I feel like Sydney Black with these blue eyes, like. You see it, you see it. So this was the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed my video and I hope that I get to see you guys in my next upcoming video. Be sure that you turn on your post notifications that way you're not missing out on any of my future uploads because this one just popped up on you, okay? I know this one just kind of popped up on you and it's a banger and you're like, what? Like, that song that I skipped was actually like, the one, yes. Yes, that's precisely what just happened. Also, be sure that you like this video so I know that you wanna see more things like this in my, in my upcoming videos. Also, be sure that you subscribe we're waiting on you. Subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my new videos. But in the meantime, between time, girl, whatever you do, wherever you are, whether you look like a Siberian Husky or you look like Zabumafu, like the little lemurs off of uh, Madagascar, I like to move it, move it. Wherever you are, remember to stay snatched 